adapting a best-selling novel is, is you have to act like a thief. You have to uh, steal the story out from the book. Uh, I think many uh, is, is too humble to the book and that they have the book too far into the production. You have to, to read the book maybe 200 times and just burn it or, or, or throw it away. Uh, you can compare it if, if you... Re have you ever read a book? You read books? Have you read a book sometimes in your life? You have? Fantastic! I don't know nowadays <laughs> if people read books, you have the audio books and so on. But, but if you read a book and you tell, uh, uh, you tell I read this good book, uh, what is that about your friend asking you? And, and you answer and maybe you tell the, the story for your friend. And there you have it. You tell the story of the book to your friend. But it's not the book story, it's Michael's story <laughs> that you tell your friend. And, and, and that's the trick. It's, it's my story from, from the book. And, and uh, then you must have some kind of highlights because of speaking of this aggressive book lovers. Uh, you must have, you, for example, in this story we have a cat. Uh, do you have cats? You have cat? Okay. Uh, pretty, you know, they, 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 you, you can't have cats on, on, on set. <laughs> it costs you a lot of money. So the production company, they didn't want to have the cat uh, in the film. And uh, I was pretty shocked because the cat had played a, a big role in the film. Uh, so I struggle for the cat, uh, and, and uh, Sweden is a very small country. We don't have uh, like uh, this digital uh, industry in, in, in Sweden as you have in here in California. So we, we bought two cats, two similar cats to, to set, uh, Magic and Orlando. And, and Magic was the aggressive cat, and Orlando was the lazy, sleepy cat. And then we used Magic for the walking scenes, and. Uh, obviously Orlando for the sleeping scenes, but they were similar. So uh, every day we, we took the wrong cat, we took the aggressive cat. <laughs> but we, we could buy new sheets instead of the bloody ones that uh, oh, yeah, occurred. You know, it's, it, it, the, the story is so beautiful. It's, a, and, and it, it, it's kind of epic because it starts way back in history, in their history. And hmm. then, Works up straight to the present, and you have you have uh, uh, magical aspects about it, it and it's, so it's really a big epic work. How um, how how easy is it to get something like this off the ground? It's it's the thing is when it, when you write uh, uh, a story which have different uh, uh, timetables like that, it, it it's it's pretty hard, and you have to tell the story uh, all the time. Uh, sometimes when you do flashback, it's like you, you just want to have a taste of everything. But I, when I wrote it, I, 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 I think it was important for me that uh, in the flashback, it, it must also be important. The things that happens in the flashbacks must, must mean something to, to the story. And, and um, compared to the book, uh, every time I cut to the flashback, uh, uh, I wanted the scene to be uh, have high tension, so, so it's like uh, uh, the, the the cut is very effective going back to 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 uh, the, the flashback scenes. It's important to say with this story about Uwe that all the flashbacks is is in his mind. Maybe it wasn't the 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 things that went out in reality, but it. It, is, it was his dreams about his, his, his uh, childhood and, and, and when he met Sonia. And that was also a reason why, why I wanted to do this film, because I, during that night when I read the book, uh, and when I read uh, the flashbacks, uh, I suddenly had the solution for the mystery in my life. When I was a boy, uh, I went uh, and looked into my, my parents' uh, albums with the black and white pictures. Uh, what they did before uh, three boys, <laughs> my brothers and one daughter, just ruined their life with them when they met and were in love and went out camping. And I've been watching these black and white photos and they didn't say anything. It, it was just photos. But when I read the book, oh, now I have the lines <laughs> as well. So it was uh, nice for me to, to shoot that scenes when, when uh, Sonia meet uh, Uwe and, and fall in love because in a way, it was my parents who fell in love with it.